Yeah, I've been real busy. Um, the, my very first day we had uh, team camp, and then we've had uh, two other camps since then. So really the first thing we had to take care of is our team camps and been and uh, our little kids camp and our elite camp. It's been really busy. We got that. We got through that. We're done with that now. And, and now we're just kind of inventorying all our gear and figuring out where we're at. Uh, we're in the process right now of uh, ordering new uniforms, uh, you know, new travel gear, new, just, you know, new, new stuff. So, uh, you know, it's just still getting my feet wet on seeing what, uh, what we have here and what we need to replace and what we need to do. Well, you know, I, I, it's a little bit hard in the summer because you, you want to try to establish a relationship with the players. And, you know, I've done a little bit of that over the phone. Um, and then some of them have been on campus here taking classes. So I have seen that. Um, so uh, just start a relationship. But when the kids get here, then we'll, we'll start uh, doing our program and how we get things done. You know, Coach Drown did a great job. And I'm sure uh, he has a way of doing things, and it was successful for him. I have a different, probably a different way of doing some things, and so that's going to be the the big difference when school, when the kids get here for school, um, you know, just establishing establishing the way I want things done. Um, it's um, it's you know sometimes people don't like change, and that can be that can be tough. But uh, I think we try to do it in a positive man manner, and I think everybody will get on board. Yeah, t good to have Tara here. She didn't get here until July 6th, I think, so about a month after I did. Um, she did come in for the camps and then went back home, but uh, glad to have her. It's going to be easier to establish our program and, and what we do. You know, she's been with me for two years, so she knows exactly what I want done. She knows my strengths. She knows my weaknesses. She can cover me for my many weaknesses probably, but uh, she's a great, uh, number one, she's just a great person and uh, the people in the community, uh, our fans and our players are going to love her because she's just a good person. And then she's, uh, you know, she's really smart. She's uh, talented at uh, individual work, working with the girls individually. Um, she's good at helping the girls in the classroom too, keeping them on task there. Um, you know, that was, a, that was the number one thing I, when I was deciding to take this job. I wanted to make sure she was going to come with me or I'm not, you know, I probably, I might have taken the job still, but that was important for me, to, for her to come here. And uh, so she'll, she's a huge part of our program. We're, we're still in the process. We're probably going to still hire a, a part-time assistant um, going through the process with that. And then, and then my son, uh, Thomas, he's, uh, he's helping us on a volunteer ba basis. And he's been a great help too with kind of the, all the little things that, uh, that we, coming up every day that we have to have to work our way through. Yeah, we'll, um, what I normally do, we'll, we'll have some team meetings when school starts. Uh, but uh, after that, I usually give them like the first week of school, just kind of let them get adjusted to things. Um, you know, that first week of school is like my first week on the job. You're just crazy and going 15 different directions. But I want them to get, you know, the freshmen and the transfers, get comfortable with the campus, get comfortable with the layout here at the school. And then we'll start our workouts. We'll, uh, we're, we haven't planned it exactly yet but in general we'll have a we'll have a day of individual work or we'll work with uh, you know the post players the guards point guards whatever uh, and then we'll do some teamwork a whole group of the team they, they changed the rule a couple years ago where we can work with them in the preseason with as a whole group for about two hours a week and then we'll do some weights and conditioning um, one thing nice here that I didn't have at Iowa Western is we have the strength and conditioning uh, coaches here and that's great they obviously do a good job I'm sure they were a big part of the football team winning a national championship so um, the kids are going to be busy between class um, our workouts and you know we're going to have some study hall too the, the seniors probably aren't going to like that but we're going to at least do that for a semester but um, you know if they're doing it right if they're doing the class work right and they're doing their workout right they 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 don't have a whole lot of time for social time um, but again, on that same token, I want them to have fun. You know, I want them, I want them, I want them to enjoy the, the um, college atmosphere, the, the experience. I want them to have a good experience. And uh, so we, we do give them enough freedom to, to do some things.